This is the micro homily for the 3rd of May. Please read the readings before listening to the homily. Well, when you read those readings, when you read the gospel, if you found yourself thinking, hang on, this is a bit familiar, it's the reading we had on Saturday. It's a quirk of the church's calendar. The reading for the 28th day of the Easter season is the same gospel reading as for the feast of St Philip and St James. And of course Easter moves around during the calendar. So on this occasion there's only two days between hearing the same gospel reading. Well, I'm not going to test your patience by saying again what I said on Saturday about that Gospel reading. In that first reading, we see how eager St Paul is both to assert that the faith he teaches is the faith he was taught, that it's the faith that the Apostles teach. And what is the centre of it? What does he bring forward as the very heart of the matter? It's the resurrection of Jesus. He lists the appearances of the risen Lord. And James is among those he lists as having met Jesus after Jesus' resurrection. Today we ask these great apostles Philip and James to pray for the church that we may keep alive that centrality of the truth of the resurrection that people may encounter Jesus as the risen Lord who is the way, the truth and the life.